What's up guys, it's Alive from the Salah High Cartel. So here's a quick hero versus villains tips. Uh, as soon as the match starts, you want to get in extremely early because if you're one of the first people that gets in, you get to play as the hero. So right there, first, first round, I get to be Luke Skywalker. This mainly just gives you an option that you're going to be at least the hero three times in one match. And of course, you want to be the hero because, you know, when you're the hero, you do tend to get a lot of uh, kills. We're actually, this is dangerous. Uh, part right here because if there's Palpatine and Boba Fett on this area All right right there. Okay, I'm gonna rush these guys. So right there. We have a Casual shock trooper. He has no idea what's going on. He's gonna die. Oh Oh, oh get back here. Oh What the fuck? Oh Shit, oh shit. Okay, there we go. So what right there what I did there. I locked onto the enemy you lock on to the enemy by pressing R1. No, you, you lock on to the enemy by pressing... My bad, guys. You lock on to the enemy by pressing... Um, R3. Yeah, R3. And then, of course, like that, you you don't lose the enemy out of your sight. Dude, we are really lagging. It's... Honestly, this kind of sucks. Oh, shit, they killed... Oh, okay. I was like, oh, my God, no, they killed Leia. And it was actually Boba Fett. Okay, we have Palpatine. I, I think he's around here. Um, okay, there he is. So sometimes the game actually reveals the location of the character by showing you, you know, kind of like that here. I'm actually going to try to flank them. I don't think this is a good idea, mainly because I don't have anybody around me. But you know what? Either way, okay, okay. No, this is, you know what? This is not a good idea. I'm just going to wait for some backup. And that's actually one thing that's, you know, the main reason why people tend to die as the heroes in Hero vs. Villains. They don't wait for backup ever. So you don't want to be the hero and rush in. You do have extra health, which is actually a huge factor. You know, a huge reason why being the hero is so good. But at the same time, you don't want to rush in as well. You want to play a little carefully. Let's see who we have here. Okay, Palpatine's here. Fuck it. I'm just going to go for it. He's taking way too long. He's pissing me off. We're going to hit him with this. We're going to hit him with this. And I'm pretty sure I'm going to finish him off. There we go. Oh, wow, I didn't finish him off, but at least I got 350 XP. Okay, so three kills. Uh, zero deaths. Actually, not that bad. I mean, if you're the hero and you get to kill at least two, that's actually pretty, pretty good. Um, we have the barrage. Okay, I actually got a new challenge of getting 25 explosive kills, so that's actually going to be pretty good. You know, I really like Star Wars Battlefront to... I really like playing Star Wars Battlefront live. Because Destiny, when I play that game live, it's, I don't know, it's it's kind of harder for me. This game is just, you can just lay back, have a good time. We're going to put the infantry turret right here, mainly because I don't want to worry about people coming up the hill. And of course, we're going to take out the barrage and... Okay. Chain lightning. Alright, so that plan kind of failed. I'm not going to spawn as the honor guard, mainly because I just want to use the barrage and the explosive grenades, all of that good stuff. Let's uh, throw that in there. Now, this is uh, the Virage. It's mainly something that I use to clear out our room or something. We're going to use this uh, cooling gel so we don't have to worry about a weapon overheating. Cooling gel, of course, lasts for three seconds. So that's actually something you guys should keep in mind. Either way, three seconds. You can do probably maybe do maybe five burst or something with the cooling gel. So it's actually not bad. Um, let me see, should I? Okay, alright, so apparently everything is working out in this match. This is probably also going to be another short match, which is actually pretty, pretty good, considering the fact that we are, uh, you know, in the... Actually, I mean, I don't know, the Rebel side, the Imperial side, like I said, everybody has their own opinions about the heroes. I feel like, you know, sometimes when you're on the hero side, you are kind of a disadvantage. It, it all depends how your teammates use the the heroes hmm okay so Leia and Luke are going this way so I'm actually just gonna go with them because I don't want to get obliterated because uh, my rebel soldiers are bad players look at that this is super cool and we have see this guy is smart I think he's an honor guard too yep he's an honor guard all right mainly we're just waiting let me actually go with Luke because Luke is a pretty good guy at DPS let's activate the rapid fire which I didn't activate oops 
and let's activate the tracking shot for Palpatine. See, Palpatine's in a disadvantage right now. He's going to get obliterated by me. Yeah, you're dead, bro. You're dead. Yeah, just, just don't run. Um, yeah, that's where Palpatine goes really, really bad. Mainly what you want to do with Palpatine, like I said on the previous episode, or on the second episode. Well, yeah, you just want to be defensive. And thank you, Leia. I think you just fucked up my kill there. We want to use rapid fire. I'm mainly just trying to get kills at this point. Mainly because I know there's only one guy left. And if I die, it doesn't really matter. Because, yeah, I'm, I, I did pretty well with Han Solo here, so... Honestly, I'm not really stressing the fact that if I get hit once, I'm going to die. Hopefully, I can get a couple of more kills here. Oh! Ladies and gentlemen, the tracking shot with Han Solo. Massive, massive damage. I can't believe I got that. I thought I was going to die for sure. Like, some Imperial dude was going to get me. Look at that. 3,000. Already. Seriously. No, this is a pretty good game. I'm not going to lie. Uh, I'm actually pretty, pretty pumped. And you know what? Um, just like Search and Destroy in Call of Duty, um, people will continue doing what's working for them. And, I mean, obviously, going down there, it's not really working for these guys. But honestly, I haven't even seen them come up here. Now that I say that, there's going to be people up here. Okay, not really. But anyways, yeah, I'm just going to flank them because these guys are... Yeah, they're just pretty much going the same way every freaking round. Okay, Boba Fett's here. I'm going to die. That was okay, though. That was okay. Uh, at least I have a Thermal Imploder, which I kind of want to waste because... Look at that. The spawns in this game. Wow. They spawned me right next to Boba Fett. Come on, man. All right. Okay, okay. I'm looking for Vader. I want to use the Thermal Imploder on him. I, I feel like the lightsaber dudes, especially Vader... They could... Oh, shit. This is great. This is great. Barrage. Impact grenades. Massive damage right there. Look at that. Oh, shit. All of them are right here. Okay. That, that kind of... That, that, kind, that kind of stuff. Um, should I... Yeah. I mean, could I even spawn as the honor guard? I don't even know if I could have spawned as the honor guard. But uh, anyways, yeah. That was actually pretty good. I had, was able to throw the thermal imploder and my entire barrage round and the impact grenade. I don't know if my impact grenade got him, but... Okay, we have Leia and Palpatine's next. Hopefully, if this person knows how to play Leia correctly. Let me see. Oh, it doesn't have a lot of health too, but... Okay. I think... Oh, no, no, no. Don't do that. Don't rush in. Are you crazy? You don't want to do that. Thermal Imploder. I think... Yeah, she's going to die. There's like three people around her. Which is pretty good. Like that, you know, the video is longer and the match, it's more interesting. Uh, but yeah, one round for the bad guys. Three guys. Three rounds for the good guys. Okay, perfect. And I get to play as Leia. This is actually a pretty cool match, dude. Uh, I played as the hero maybe, what, four? Three? No, three times. I'm not good at math, so, you know, I don't really keep a lot of count. But yeah, let's do this. Where is Luke going? We're going this way? Okay, let's do it, bro. And look at that. I'm already getting damage. That was probably Boba Fett's uh, wrist rocket. Let's put these guys here. And, of course, pick up some health. And look at that. We already have Palpatine here. I got this. Don't don't worry. Oh, no, no. Why are you running from me? You're running. You're running. And now my strategy isn't going to be worth it. Come on. Come on, Han Solo. Come on, Luke Skywalker. Come on, brother. Well, yeah, yeah. That's right, because Luke is uh, Leia's brother. I knew that. Um, oh, shit. No, no, no. This is not good. This is not good. Let's use this. The, well, dude, my my aim with Trooper Bane is horrible sometimes. That's why, like, if you guys ask me what are my favorite heroes to play as in the Rebel side, it's Luke Skywalker first, then Han Solo. And sometimes, in some cases, depending on the map, Han Solo is my favorite one. Because, I don't know, with Leia, I'm really bad with Trooper Bane. I'm not extremely good when it comes to support. I mean, I'm, I don't know, I guess I'm average, because I do play Emperor Palpatine pretty well, in my opinion, but... These guys are probably going to come up top, so let's just risk it. Let's waste this barrage. If I get a damage, I'll just go down. I didn't get any damage, so... You know what? Whatever. My character just doesn't want to go up, so... And, um, okay, I'm not dead. I thought I was going to be dead. But, yeah, the pulse cannon got me. Okay, I'll spawn as the honor guard here. 
yeah, that 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 sucked. I was actually expecting to, uh, you know, get some damage on Vader. And of course, here we have uh, Boba Fett. Let's throw a grenade. Okay, yeah, that 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 sucked. Okay, so yeah, Boba Fett mainly it's going to be trouble if you just let him fly around. Oh, and by the way, guys, I just want to give you guys a tip, which is not really going to be an extremely useful one, but I don't know, maybe it could help you guys out. I thought those guys were bad guys. Uh, yeah, Boba Fett, if you shoot the jetpack, you actually do some damage. And there we go, my barrage come in handy, 225. Uh, damage in total and I died obviously because the saber throw it's pretty great uh, so if you guys want more range on the saber throw you could also press R3 and you know lock onto the enemy and then press R1 you know, I'm actually waiting for them to come by because I know they're gonna come by here all right so they didn't do much there but at least look at that Boba Fett's on 22% we have hand solo left I think we might be able to win this round if we play correctly but I don't know. Okay. Honestly, I mainly just want the game to end already. Because I don't want the Hero vs. Villains episodes to be that long. But at the same time, if they're long, they're more interesting. So, yeah. That's also another reason why I want them to be long. But I don't know. Look at that. I get to play as Leia. Bad luck for me, I guess. Whatever. <laughs> I'll, I'll do my best. I'll do my best. Hopefully these guys go to the top and flank them. Okay, all right, you just want to go around. All right, let's do that. All right, so let's 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 hang out together. The three of us, the the original team, the original dream team. Yeah, I believe in part six. Yeah, these guys were together. I haven't seen the Star Wars films a lot of times, so obviously I don't know a lot about the Star Wars lore, honestly. Let's uh let's spawn this shit in here. Okay. Come on team. Come on team. Where are they? Oh my god. Oh! Oh, trooper bane. Oh yeah. Okay. Let's uh let's do this. Let's activate this. Yo, these guys are gonna kill us from being on the top. I just know it. It's a fact. It's gonna happen. Dude, there's health there. I need to get that health. I have 56%. Let's get this too. Come on! Yes! Trooper Bane kind of worked there. Oh! Yes, perfect. And there we go. Um, okay, where the hell is Boba Fett? Okay, so we have Boba Fett and Vader. It would be pretty cool if this game mode would give you the option to see how much health... Oh, yeah, bitch, you're going down. Fuck yeah. Okay, we have, uh, this dude left. Come on, man. We got this team. Picked up a little bit of health. We're gonna open. Oh, okay, perfect. All right, that was a pretty beastly game. Uh, I believe it was the hero five or four times. Like I said, I'm not that good with numbers, guys. But look at that, five thousand seven hundred and eighty-nine. And look at the dude on the top, man, nine k. I I rarely get to the top unless it's a pretty good map. But look at that, most kills as hero eighteen. Beasted, straight up beasted. Let me see how much XP I got in this game. Alright, so I got 5,000, and I didn't even do any of my challenges, because I was mainly playing as a hero as well. Game bonus, 1,000. Okay, 500. Alright, that's not that bad. I got a total of 7k. Alright guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode of Hero vs. Villains Live. If you did, make sure to drop a like, and make sure to subscribe to join the Sabaya Cartel. I'll see you guys on my next video. Peace out.